it's a it's a new genre of customer for the power sport industry to go after. I think that we share the same roots, uh, the same DNA. Leaders in the car industry, it's nothing better than, you know, talking to those kind of people. But what SEMA is, is a lifestyle show. And it's about that lifestyle of performance. I think it's going to be uh, pretty mind-blowing. SEMA started with 13 companies underneath the bleachers at Dodger Stadium in 1967. My dad started an amazing brand back in 1973 and you know going to SEMA for me as a kid was you know always the, like the mecca of all the shows. SEMA is actually the largest gathering of small businesses in the United States. They take up the entire Las Vegas Convention Center. 100 countries will be represented, at least 100 TV stations. Same as bitching. All the guys that started the industry from hot rotting to um, retail. There'll be at least 2,000 uh, exhibitors at the show. Uh, the 2 million square feet or so inside, everything from wheels and tires to motorsports. The new power sports side of things where, uh, you know, motorcycles and ATVs are crossing over now, street bikes. It's like a college education out there for me every year. I go there and I just learn about what to do and what not to do. Enthusiast is the common denominator. A lot of hot rod bikes, a lot of hot rod cars, and that common denominator is that person that that's their hobby. So many people come to the SEMA show, you know, that ride dirt bikes and ride street bikes or mountain bikes, but they also have, you know, trucks. It's definitely good to listen to the, the people that work with the OEMs and, um, and see how they connect. Uh, it's a, absolutely the next level. Uh, and it's something that the power sport world can, can look towards. We can all learn from each other, you know, it's like I go to a surf contest, you know, I learned something too. I go to a skateboard contest, I learned something. Right, the, the car business has been around for a long time. There are a lot of great takeaways that people can apply. There are a lot of neat trends that can also be applied towards your store and towards your business. And I send my artist out there and a lot of crossover. I mean, there's just, you know, there's 150,000 people going through there. And Where do you get that knowledge? You come to the SEMA show and you hear it from folks like uh, Joe Gibbs Racing Oil. You know, I think that we realize that, you know, half the people that are coming to that show probably either ride a motorcycle or a mountain bike, you know, and that's, that's our business. We could really work on is our fall calendar because I think that's when the, the new models have already been released. Usually with motocross bikes, it's August, September. Uh, the new gear comes out at the end of the season, uh, which is Labor Day. Uh, people are looking forward to next year already. SEMA shows the first week in November, Las Vegas. You can have fun at the event, more fun at nighttime. It's fun when you have some, you know, good after time, after party stuff. Weather's great, the casinos, the clubs, let's party. I've been to Vegas many times, but I don't really remember anything about the place. I remember an, an airport, a police car. I remember a sad phone call to my father. SEMA makes you smile. SEMA gets you excited, the buzz, the enthusiasm. Right now the motorcycle market needs a boost. Uh, I think there's room for uh, more opportunities for B2B and uh, specifically November. And if you can't have fun doing what you love, there's no point doing it.